I've actually heard this fellow's name pronounced two different ways. I've heard Trevor Zegra and Trevor Zegris. Zegra came when they drafted him, but uh, I've heard Zegris at the World Juniors, and it's also on Elite Prospects, so I'm, I'm gonna go with that one. Trevor was drafted ninth overall in the 2019 NHL entry draft to the Anaheim Ducks, or the Mighty Ducks of Anaheim, if you prefer. In the most recent World Juniors tournament, Trevor Zegris was on the United States team that won the gold medal, and he was also named the tournament MVP. As of when I'm making this video, he is about to make his debut, and on that note, I would like to say shout out to Lucas, who actually messaged me earlier today, and said, he's about to make his big debut, do a career sim now. So let's hop into it and let's see what EA Sports thinks is going to happen in the career of Trevor Zegris. Now he's still not in the game. I'm assuming that EA needs to get some paperwork done and all that jazz, but either way, we were able to create him. Thank you to Super Highway Gaming for the video on how to create him. So he's medium elite, 76 overall, and he actually ended up getting called up to the roster in year one, putting up three points in four playoff games, but they were swept by the Oilers in round one here. And the top retiring player for the first season is going to be Marion Hossa. And now let's jump into year number two, where Zegris is already on the first line. He's going to be playing with Raquel and Lee. The defense looks pretty solid, and they got Gibson backed up by Pekka Rene. The team will finish first in the Pacific Division, and Zegris will put up 70 points in 77 games, also putting up two points in five playoff games. The Lightning win the Cup and the President's Trophy. The Ducks eliminated in five games this time. The Golden Knights took them out in round one. And Patty Marlowe is going to be the top retiring player this season. Moving on to year number three. Still on the first line, Terry and Lee going to be the wingers this time around. Jones and Fowler as a top defensive pair. And Gibson will still be in the net. The team finishes third in the Pacific with 89 points. Zegris puts up 76 points in 71 games. Four points in seven playoff games. The Leafs with the Cup. The Capitals with the President's Trophy. And the Ducks... Seven games this time, they're making progress in round one to the San Jose Sharks, and Jumbo Joe is the top retiring player this season. In year number four, Zegris will be playing with Kerfoot and Silverberg on the first line, 88 overall, Fowler Jones still the number one pair, and Gibson still in net at 89 overall. He signs a big ticket here, eight years at 10.32, that's massive, too bad. The team does not have a stellar year. 34 wins this time around last in the Pacific. But Zegris finishes second in the league with 102 points. Team might not have performed, but he sure did. Flyers with the cup. Capitals with the presidents and Stahl, the top retiring player. These wingers seem to be shifting quite a bit. Terry and Steele will now be the respective wingers for Zegris this year. And Gibson, 90 overall, still going to be the starting goaltender. The team just misses the playoffs, 88 points, finishing fourth in the Pacific. Zegris puts up 81 points in 80 games, 40 goals, 41 helpers. The Leafs win the cup, Capitals with another presidents, and Evgeny Malkin will be the top retiring player for this season. Moving on to year number six here, where Zegris will be playing with Max Comtois and Dixon on the first line. Fowler and Jones, the top pair. Gibson, the starting goaltender. The team finishes fifth in the Pacific with 86 points, missing out on the playoffs. 85 points in 82 games this year for Trevor. The Rangers win the Stanley Cup. The Lightning get the President's Trophy. And Trevor wins himself a Selkie. So there you go. Ovechkin will be the top retiring player this season. Moving on to year number seven, still on the first line here at 89 overall, a little bit of a winger shuffle again, and the defense looks like this, Gibson still the starting goaltender here, the team sucks, they finish with 32 wins, 71 points, Zegris will put up 73 points in 81 games, the Canadians are the Stanley Cup champions, Colorado with the presidents, Trevor wins himself another Selkie, and Crosby is the top retiring player this year. Continuing to year number eight now, where Zegris will be playing with Verona and Dixon on the first line. Comiskey and Jones, the top pair, but the defense looking a little rough there, honestly. Gibson, 81 overall, the starting goaltender. The Ducks finish sixth in the Pacific. Not good enough for the playoffs. 80 points from Zegris in 82 games. The Islanders with the Stanley Cup. Tampa Bay takes the precedence. Another Selkie for Trevor here. That's three in a row. Patty Kane, which is Zegris' favorite player, by the way, top retiring player this year. 
the final year before the double digits, Dixon and Lonin, Yelonen, I don't know how to pronounce that, honestly, but I gave it a shot. That's for sure. Vazzy going to be the starting goaltender. The team finishes seventh in the Pacific with 26 wins. Zegris puts up 73 points in 82 games. The Canucks are Stanley Cup champions. The Lightning with the Presidents four in a row. And Kucherov will be the top retiring player this season, getting just over 1,400. And now we are entering the double digits. Zegris playing with Vrana and uh, Mika. <laughs> the defense still looking rough for sure. Vazzy, the starting goaltender. And the team will, by a miracle, make the playoffs here. 88 points, 39 wins, fifth in the Pacific Division. Zegris puts up 75 points in 82 games with a plus eight. Also eight points in six playoff games. The Rangers are the Stanley Cup champions. The Presidents goes to Toronto. Honestly, just rename the trophy at this point. And the Mighty Ducks of Anaheim were eliminated by the Kings in round one, taking six games. Artemi Panarin is the top retiring player this season. Year number 11 is upon us, and Zegris will be playing with Mika and Jesper Bratt. The defense still not looking tremendous, goaltending falling down again. I don't know what it is with this team, but 22 wins, 47 points. That is horrendous. Zegris only played... 43 games this year and put up 25 points with a dash 12. The Rangers win the Stanley Cup and the President's Trophy. And Tyler Sagan will be the top retiring player for year number 11. Continuing on here, that first line looks disgusting. Now they got Mika, Trevor, and Martindale all together. That is disgusting. The defense looks a little bit better as well. Goaltending looks meh, but, you know, it could get the job done. Another big ticket here. Eight years at 10.66 six this time. The team finishes seventh in the Pacific with 73 points. 85 points in 81 games from Zegris. Vancouver Canucks with the Stanley Cup. The Senators with the President's Trophy and Braden Point will be the top retiring player for year number 12. And we'll continue on here in year number 13, where Martindale, Zegris, and Mika still in the first line. A very good first line. The defense looks not horrible. They don't really have a goalie, though, and they finish last in the Pacific. This team just cannot figure it out. 95 points in 82 games from Trevor, though. He's performing. The Buffalo Sabres with the Stanley Cup. The Avalanche with the President's Trophy. And Connor McDubstep is the top retiring player for year 13. And we will continue on here. Zegris, Martindale, and Mika still on the first line. The defense looks pretty good here, actually. They have a decent goaltender pair as well, and they will finish fifth in the Pacific with 87 points. Zegris will put up 77 points in 82 games with a dash one and put up two points in six playoff games. The Coyotes win both the President's Trophy and the Stanley Cup. Zegris winning himself another Selkie here, and the team would be eliminated by the Arizona Coyotes in round one, taking six games. Mitchell Marner, the top retiring player this season. Entering year number 15 now, Zegris, Martindale, and Mika still on the first line. The defense looks not too bad. They do have the 277s, but it's all right. It works out. 87 overall, McClement is the starter. They finish first in the Pacific with 100 points. Zegris gets 102 points with a plus 17 in 73 games and two playoff points in six games. Chicago wins the Stanley Cup. Montreal with the President's Trophy and the team that won the Stanley Cup, Chicago, deleted the Ducks in round number one, taking five games. Nate Mack is the top retiring player for year 15. And now we move on to year 16, where Martindale, Zegris, and Mika still on the first line. They've been together for quite some time now. The defense looks rough. Goaltending, they got McClement, but it's just not going to do it. This team cannot figure it out. 74 points last in the Pacific. 94 points, though, and a plus 21 for Zegris. Tampa Bay wins the Cup. Dallas with the Presidents. And Rantanen will be the top retiring player this year. Moving forward here, we've got Zegra still on the first line, 90 overall. Mika and Martindale still going to be the wingers. McClement is also still the starting goaltender. I really don't know what's going on with this team. 28 wins, 70 points, last in the Pacific. 84 points in 77 from Zegras. Washington wins the cup. The Presidents goes to Ottawa. And Leon Dreisaitl is the top retiring player this year, getting over 1,800. And now we move on to year 18, where Mika is no longer with the team. Walters is the new right winger on the first line there. McClement still the starting goaltender. The team finishes sixth in the Pacific with 38 wins, 81 points. Zegris puts up 68 points in 77 with a dash one. The Canadians with the cup. 
the Rangers with the President's Trophy, and Pedersen will be the top retiring player for year number 18. Zegras is starting to get up there in age, and he is now down to 83 overall. He'll be playing with Triff and Martindale. The team looks all right, but still not spectacular. They finished 7th in the Pacific with 28 wins. They really just can't figure it out. 39 points, 61 games. Philadelphia wins the Cup, Montreal with the Presidents, and Zegras would call it quits this year. Just shy of 1,400 points there and playing just over 1,400 games. Very close to a pointy game player. 19 seasons and only 28 playoff games. They just couldn't make a run. So looking back at a bit of a career summary here, Zegris signed 19 years worth of contracts and made an estimated just over $170 million. So he did all right. For trophies, he won seven Selkies and that was about it. Unfortunately, no presidents no Stanley Cup, anything like that. And he was loyal to Anaheim, playing there for his whole career. If we have a look at the all-time point leaders, Trevor finished number 44 all-time in between Yari Curry and Luke Robitaille. So that is still some pretty elite company right there. He did all right, even though his team couldn't exactly figure it out. You know, he still finished among two great players, so... Yeah, great career. Thank you guys for watching the video. I really tried to get this done. I actually made this in one day somehow. I don't even know how I managed to do that, but I pulled it off. So if you guys could leave a like, that'd be greatly appreciated. And I don't even know. I think his game is starting very soon. So hopefully he does good in his NHL debut. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you later.